John Blackmore here at LeeJohnBlackmore.com. This week we're doing Black Dog by Led Zeppelin. Let's get straight into it. Take your third finger and place it on the A string, the fifth string, at the seventh fret. First finger, then fifth fret on the D string, the fourth string. That's going to climb up. Six, seven. So far, A string, seven on the A string. 5 on the D, climb up, 6, 7, notice how I'm using my 1st, 2nd and 3rd finger, then go back to the 1st note, 7th fret on the A string. Next you want to use the 1st finger and you want to go to the G string at the 5th fret, and there's a little half bend on there. Landing my third finger on the seventh fret on the D string. Okay, so far. That's your first section, guys. Next section, we uh, we uh, move the first finger up to the seventh fret on the G string. And we're going to do 7, 9. Uh, the 9 I'm playing with my third finger. Alright, so, so far from the beginning. The next bit, you want to move that first finger down to the 5th fret. And the 7th finger is going to hammer on pull off on the 7th. Okay? If you don't know what hammer-on is, it's where you pluck the string, hammer the finger down onto the next fret, okay? And so I see a lot of people doing this, sort of plucking, and then just placing the finger down on the fret they want to make the hammer-on, but that's not really the case. You have to hammer the finger down, and then to get a pull-off, just pull it off straight away. Okay, and you get two notes there, five and seven. If you can't get the hammer on and pull off straight away, you can just pluck them, okay? So far from the beginning. All right. Next bit, third finger on the D string. Seventh fret. From the beginning. Next bit, first finger, G string, fifth fret. Okay, if you put those two bits together, seventh fret on the D string, fifth fret on the G. Little bend and snap back to the seventh fret on the D string. That's what you're looking looking for, really. Okay. Okay. And the last bit. So that's going to be the uh, fifth fret on the D string. Then 7th fret twice, also on the D string. Move that over then onto the A string. Then play 5-7 on the A string. Then 3-5, also on the A string. 
then open A. And you can do a little A power chord. The whole thing from the top. And then that repeats again, and you've got this like chorus section. Okay, so we're going to go now we're on the bottom E string, seven on the bottom E string, seventh fret, third finger. Now, the, the beginning section is pretty much like the last one we played, but on the lower strings. So we're going to go 7 on the E string, 5 on the A string, climb up, 6, 7, stay on the A string. So we got... Then play that first 7 note again on the bottom E. D string. 5th fret, 8th uh, string, 7th fret, so notice I've put a little half bend on there as well, like the, like the first time around. That happens again, and again. Then we've got this changeover, and it goes like the beginning, 7, 5 on the A string, climb up 6, 7, then 5 again, 7, still on the A string, then go back to the begin riff. So if I play that second bit slowly, So that turnaround section can be a little bit tricky. I'll show you the part that I'm talking about. So So it's where we come from the low E section. And then it goes. So what I'm doing there, okay? So on the change bit, seven on the E string. goes 5 again on the A, 7 on the A, now I'm 5 on the D, 6, 7 on the D, 5 on the A, you half bend on the G, back down to 7 on the D. So I hope that helps you guys. Uh, that's it for this week, Black Dog by Led Zeppelin. Don't forget to subscribe to my YouTube channel. I do these lessons every week. Uh, if you have any requests, send me a request. If you have any comments, please leave a comment. You can follow me on Instagram, you can follow me on Facebook. I'll see you the same time next week, guys.